Ia aku de bayo el bebe kim. Ia aku de bayo la papa. El aku de bayo el bebe kim. Adios. Oh yeah, I hear that today. We're gonna be making arts and crafts. Oh, that's cool. Um, ma'am, ma'am, what's wrong with Keem? El goodbye, el bebe. Yeah, he usually only says goodbye to baby Keem. No, 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 why does he look like that? <laughs> Malakachi. Mm. Oh, uh, um, he, you know, he lives in that apartment now. He was walking up the stairs. Uh, he didn't take the elevator. He was walking up the stairs, and then he fell down, and so he's, you know, covered in bandages. But why does he have glasses? El goodbye, Miss Egan. All right, well, see you later, guys. Yeah, bye, baby Danny. Come on, checkers. I'm coming. Don't access me. All right, kids, so since this is kind of a preschool slash daycare, and since it is connected to the Washington County Regional Elementary School, the, uh, the, the superintendent is going to have an observation in here, so. An observation? Isn't that, like, when those doctors come in and then, like, put Q-tips in your eye and scream, What did you do? What did you do? What? No, that isn't what happens, baby Howard. No, it's that, um, do you know what the superintendent is? Wow, isn't it like that gaming console? No, no, it, it it's like the, the person who, it, it's like the, the, per, the person who has a higher authority than the principal. So you mean like the El Presidente? No, not the El Presidente! But who else would have a higher authority than a principal? Oh, it's God. No, it is not God! So is it the bus? Oh, no, wait, <laughs> I'm the bus. Uh, Miss Teacher? Uh, yeah, what is it, baby Timmy? The superintendent isn't gonna hurt us, is he? No! Oh man, if the superintendent come in here trying to hurt me, then I, I'm, I'm probably gonna throw some hands, man. Oh, oh, no you won't. I will be the one throwing my hands. You'll say it's easy for you to say, but you don't have any hands. Well, excuse me. All right, no one's hurting the, the, the superintendent, okay? Is he gonna hurt you? What? The superintendent. Is he going to hurt you? No, why would he do that? Are you afraid you're gonna get fired, Miss Teacher? What, what are you talking about? You know, I heard that, that um, there was some teacher in New Hampshire that got so fired by the superintendent that she literally got on fire. Oh, that's ridiculous. That's that stuff that those conspiracy theorists tell you. Uh, no, I'm not that scared. Uh, no. What? You really think these students are disciplined enough? Do you really think that? What? What, what, what are you talking about? Oh, oh, yeah, that's right, Miss Peterson. You don't know how to take care of any children. He's going to walk in through this door and you're going to get fired. Ah, uh, no. Wait, 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 what's the superintendent's name? His name is... I don't want to say his name. What? Why don't you want to say his name? Because I'm scared, all right? I'm scared. All right, all right, what's his name? His name is Mr. Gargantuan. Listen up, listen up real good. Your little preschool or daycare or whatever it is, it ain't gonna be easy no more. Nope, mm mm mm. <laughs> oh, I'm so scared. I am so scared. Oh, oh, what are you gonna do? You're gonna cry. You're gonna cry your little eyes out. Well, listen, it just gets harder after this. It's all downhill once you turn three. Yep, that's right. But it won't be with your superintendent, Mr. Gargantuan. All right, thank you, thank you so much. I am Mr. Gargantuan, and I am going to observe this preschool or daycare, whatever it was, whatever it is, who cares? Hello, Miss Peterson? Or, uh, uh, hello, Mr. Gargantuan. Shake my hand, will ya? Oh, okay. Thank you. Oh, I'm excited to, uh, to meet all of you guys. Yep. Whoa, whoa, hold up. That's Mr. Gargantuan? So what was that other guy's name? 
Or that was the superintendent's assistant. His name's Mr. Microscopic. Oh. Miss Peterson, what is your first name? Uh, L. E L L E. All right, L. I'm uh, j just, you know, teacher class, like, you know, how you always do. I just wanted to know your name so it could be a safe environment for all these kids. Nice, comforting, you know. So, um, yeah, I'm just going to sit in the back, just carrying on with what you usually do with, you know, with all your kids. And I'll, I'll just criticize if there are any problems. But I I'm, I'm sure it'll all be fine. I'm sure there'll be no problems. All right, that's good, Mr. Gargantuan. Hmm. All right, guys. So, we're going to get started with the arts and crafts. So, shoot, stab, mother, kill. You, you just said the four banned words. Uh, what banned words, Miss Teacher? The, the four banned words. You can't, you know, the, shoot, stab, murder, and, you know, the other one. Kill? Ah! Put my ears to see me. You know that you cannot say those words in 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 this property. You realize that, right? You've gone to all the code of conduct assemblies. But this is a daycare. I mean, kind of. It's like a daycare preschool thing. All right. Both of you go to the timeout chair. I'm not an idol, man. You said kill. What? I just said kill. I didn't say shoot, stab, and murder. Crap. Go to the timeout chair right now. All right. All right, well, we lost. Come on, baby Seth. <sighs> um, Al, uh, can I can I talk to you for a second? I yeah, sure. What is it? No, no, no. We have, we have to go over here. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. Um, is there something wrong with my form of punishment, uh, um, superintendent? Well, no, it's just that. What are you doing? What? You you put those kids in a timeout chair. You can't do that. What? Why right not? The timeout chair falls under cruel and unusual punishment, Miss Peterson, and I'm afraid that you just broke the law. What are you talking about? Yep, that's right. You can't put kids in the timeout chair anymore. Mm -mm -mm, that is not cool. You should know. All right, where am I supposed to find this out? Oh, I know the Bible. No. All right, what am I supposed to do? Oh, I see you're inexperienced, so I'll handle this. You know, these kids are the future, you know. All right, kids, I'm going to discipline you the Mr. Gargantuan way. What are you going to do, man? Give us a spanking? Ah, oh, yes. Are you going to set us on fire? Or, or are you going to put a Q-tip in their eyes and lean over them and go, What did you do? What did you do? Don't make me bring out the scissors. Do you want me to bring out the scissors? No? Then I suggest you start talking. What? All right, anyway... I'm going to show you how it's done. All right, kitties, I'm uh, beginning to scratch the surface of beginning to understand that you two, or maybe just one of you, or may possibly none of you, may have done something that would not be acceptable in this certain type of environment. However, it would be possible in different types of environment, perhaps different dimensions. If you believe in the multiverse, you don't have to. It's all your choice. So I'm just saying that just in case if you guys happen to do something that would not be acceptable, which it, maybe it was, then I'm just saying that maybe it would be wise to start realizing that it would be necessary to maybe prevent yourself from thinking about maybe carrying out these actions. Here's a five for you, and here's a five for you. Equal pay to crisp dollar bills. Sit down, kids. Oh, I'm getting in trouble more often. Mr. Gargantuan, what was that? Oh, that was just, you know, the new age of discipline. Earth to L, Earth to L, we are living in 2019. But that's not how you discipline a child. Oh, you know, I think I'm going to get myself a nice cap. Yeah, I think I'm going to get myself a knife. You see, you see, that's not, you, you can't do that. Oh, really? Well, think of the relationship here. I am a superintendent. I could literally do whatever I want. You are just... You're almost a teacher. I can't even believe I'm speaking to you. <laughs> All right. All right, kids. So uh, we're, we're going to do the arts and crafts still. So, um... Wow! I think that it will be necessary right now for me to hit baby Danny as hard as I can. Oh! Al, I'll let you handle this one. Uh, okay. Um, hey, baby Baki. Oh, yeah? 
All right, so I'm, I'm beginning to understand. I'm beginning to understand. No, I, I can't help you out. Sorry, I, I started to. No, just, just do it on your own. I'm beginning to understand that a situation is rising. Ooh, don't say situation. Why? It has a slight negative annotation, and that could really harm the growth of these children. Ah! I just remembered. I'm late to my meeting. Oh, no, you can't go to the meeting. Oh, do, do not use negatives. I just told you, when you use negatives, it it really hurts him. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. What? No, sir, this is really serious. I have to go to the meeting. I know. I know there's stuff going on, but seriously, I have to go right now. All right, listen, can, can, can't you just... Yeah, ask questions, that's good. Can, can't you just stay here? No, 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 you can't... That was suggestive. All right, you know what? I have the ability right now to be able to scratch the surface to believe that you are endangering this environment that I've created in my classroom and you are harmfully disrupting these students in a, in a matter that, that should not be used. However, it might be correct, but I just don't know because I'm stupid. So whatever, here's $15, leave. I would suggest that you didn't say leave because that was, you know, that was very commanding. But, but yeah, that was pretty good. You're not fired.